Okay, it's time to do today's Seas of Scred daily. I missed yesterday's, but uh, in fairness, Pillars of Eternity had come out, and I did kickstart it, so uh, yeah, that's what I was doing. So, let's see, which we're in the C64, I think. Yeah, so let's change the sprite mode to Chasm, because I wanted to have a look at that yesterday. Turn to main menu. So, daily seed, start game. So the ships look a bit different here. That's kind of cool. I like it. All right. So heavy as usual because I want to win this again and actually have it recorded. So okay, neutronium is a blue up spiky looking thing, and a pearls is a down spike type of thing. Don't run out of air. Hmm, I'll try not to. Big bulls this time. This is an interesting spray mod. Let's just see what Nithronium is in fact worth. And here. 125, that's not great, but it's not the worst, I suppose. Another four and I can come back and get the bio acquire because damn it, I'm gonna make this work. It's also very rare in this mod. Oh, Cravens are kind of strange looking creatures here. Here we go, there's a few more here. So Cravens is definitely worth more than Nithronium on this dive, so I want to get the bio acquire sooner rather than later. My long-term goals for this game really is get good enough that I can win consistently. So learning patience is going to be key. And uh, then once I do that, I might try a few different tactics, the other ships, and um, go deeper. So buyer, buy over. There we go. I don't need any air just yet. So again, I'm just going for a pure out and out win. That's all I want. I just want to beat this game. Don't want to get those guys because they're not worth a lot. Blotfish are only worth 20, so it's not worth picking them up. But these guys, totally worth picking up. Craven's 200. Oh, I should have checked the price of pearls. Anyway. <laughs> Look at me doing stuff. Oh, I missed one. Can't win them all. Or, you know, can only win one and then forget to record it. Whoops. Okay, so this should probably fill up my cargo. No, oh, space for one. I might as well get it. Ah, one on his own. And back to surface. Yep, an arrow did for me in the last run, the day before yesterday. Yeah, it was a pity, but that's the life. So this should net me maybe two round, three round, four round, who knows. 25 times 20 ish. Let's see what the pearls are worth as well. Hopefully a lot more than the Nithronium. Usually they're over 200 anyway, so that'll be useful. 339 for the pearls, that is pretty damn good. I like it. I'm up to seven grand already. Okay. Try not to die. Try not to die. I'm trying to avoid the blobfish because uh, it's just not worth it. <laughs> Bubble of air is stopping that one from moving. I will leave him where he is. Ooh, that was kind of dangerous. Ah, I forgot to get rid of my Cravens that time. Oh well. Ah, and I picked up a Bluffish. Oh, that's only one so far. No, so more Nithronium. Oh 
And look, there's a craven. Ooh, more cravens. Still plenty of room in the cargo bay for more. Okay, so that's a pearl. Worth the 300. They are m depth charges, I'm presuming. Oh, now look. Now we get the craven. So let's see what that's worth. Get back to the surface on half air. I won't be stopping to pick anything up. Just for delicate maneuvers, of which I think there is a necessity for one or two of those. A little just up here a bit. Don't care about the blockfish now, I'm not going to pick them up. Those there will come in useful for my next dive. I just avoid arrows, even if they don't look like they'd be dangerous, I just avoid arrows on principle. Good to stay in good practice. So will 6 air get me 200 fathoms up? We'll see. My internet is going crazy, so I don't even know if I'm going to get this up today. And by going crazy, I of course mean isn't connected at all. So the last one netted me about five grand, so this should net me maybe six. I might buy some air to get me down to the very de deep depths. Yeah. All right, pretty good. So 14 grand, another 11 grand. I was seven, so that was just kind of about another seven. So another, mm, looks like I'm gonna have to do a few dives. But we'll be getting more pearls than anything in the next run, so. Um, mm, I won't get air this time, I'll get air next time. Continue trying to avoid blobfish. Eek. So that's an air there. There's quite a bit of air, so I could probably get down as far as I can in, in half a tank or maybe three quarters of a tank and then use the rest to get back up. So I hope I get enough. Ah, damn. Well, it was bound to happen. Right. So we're making good progress here. 200 down and only 4 units of air gone. Ah, again. Oh dear. Getting off just far too many blockfish at this stage. Gonna make this worthwhile. So, um, at Darkest Kale's ne previous game, Quarries of Scred is getting an ultra difficult update. And there's another one because I was talking. An ultra difficult update, I believe, which is going to be crazy. So I might do a couple of daily challenges on that. I will pro probably only last a couple of seconds <laughs> because I'm, oh, you think I'm bad at this game? Oh, I'm terrible at the other. All right, so Craven Nathronium, not Nathronium, a pearl. Another stupid blockfish. Ah, I missed it. We're doing pretty good for air. Uh, a blockfish hatchery. I don't like those. So I 
need to make 11 grand for uh, to not have to come back up. Can I do it? Can I, can I, can I? Pretty please, with sugar on top. Alright, try to avoid this blackfish. Yep. Okay, so air is still... Oof. somewhere but I'm certain. Okay, so they're really dark depths. Great. So I'll grab that air and pretty much every air on the way back up I suspect. Two more, great. I'll get that one. Should be like a little sound effect, Kale. Every time we get air, like the, the sonic whoop whoop. We got some deep breaths there. Now I'm scared I won't make it with my hard earned winnings. Not winnings. Spoils. Loot. I think I could do it. If I have to come down again, I'll definitely need some air canisters. That's going to be a nightmare coming back, going down. 400. I won't need any more air, I don't think. I'll skip this one. area. I don't want to die. Not with all my loot. 300. I'll get this one. Ooh. That's why those arrows are dangerous. They can kill you, much like literally everything else in this game. Still doing good for and I know there's one or two more of these to go in case I'm not. Those like stray sections, they're like false sense of security time. Alright, so I should be able to do it with just the air bubbles alone. Put the C. I might grab one or two more if I'm not making good time, but it looks like I'm making good time. The only problem might be those blockfish in my cargo bay. They might have just taken the edge off all the money I could earn. Because right there, there's four of them, so that's 80, when it could have been like over a grand if I was collecting pearls. So they can have a big effect on your cargo. Sixty-five, sixty-six. Alright. Okay, so buffish, don't kid it. Still. Ah, jeez, I only had one air there, so that was a bit mad. Sell my cravens, sell my blobfish, 15. Now, if I can get 10 grand for 15 pearls. Oh, look at that. That is game one, and it's recorded. Oh, yes. So, um, I don't want to buy, I want to buy the research vessel. And I want to buy the teleporter ticket to win the game. Boom. <sighs> Won the game. Sweet. <laughs> so let's have a look at the breakdown. Um, game mode daily, as you know. You can see this, that random number there that generated the level. Today's date, lovely. So credits 671. Not a lot left over, let's be honest. Uh, that's probably because I just bet it off. So my death, this is probably the the biggest limiting factor obviously because it's times 40 on how deep I went. The time I won I had a depth of 1071 a max depth so that really added to my score. Uh, final air 360 same as last time actually. Nothing from the stores there because I had nothing in my in my cargo bay. So I got my times 6 bonus. I didn't get a stores bonus because oh what the hey. 
And my final score, 72,728 press F12 to tweet your daily score. Well, let me just turn on Firefox here. And even though my internet is crap, I'm going to try and uh, give it a shot. Just wait till it boots up. It's a bit here we go, right, so F12. And that's appearing over here, so I will say thank you. And until next time intrepid explorers.